let us have a look at some important questions of shares and dividends the question read, reads out a man invests rupees 800 in buying rupees 5 shares when they are selling at a premium of rupees 500 rupees 1.15 he sells all the shares so find his profit percent and the find his profit and the net profit percent so we'll proceed as it is given that nominal value is rupees 5 shares so nominal value of one share is given as rupees 5 okay so market value will be rupees 5 plus the premium so premium is given as 1.15 so that comes out to be rupees 6.15 now it is given that total money invested is rupees 800 total money invested is rupees 800 so how will we find the number of shares purchased number of shares purchased will be equal to the total money invested upon the nominal value so number of shares the chapter is totally formula driven we should just be clear about when to use what formula so number of shares purchased is equal to total money invested upon the market value of one share that will be equal to 160 now we can find out the market value of these 160 shares so therefore market value of 160 shares will be equal to market value of one uh, one sorry 160 into market value of one share so that will be 6.15 into 160 that comes out to be rupees 984 now we need to find his profit and the profit person so profit will be equal to market value of 160 shares minus total money invested that's very obvious so therefore profit is equal to his profit the man's profit is equal to market value of 160 shares that is rupees 984 minus the total money invested so that comes out to be rupees 184 so therefore profit percent will be equal to the profit upon total money invested into 100 so that comes out to be 23 percent and hence we get our answer